My name is Divya Parmar. So I'm the program director for the Masters in Public Health program at City. City first Masters in Public Health is an internationally recognized degree. So it helps students to get opportunities and work in public health. It also helps students to uh, design and lead public health programs. I chose to study at City because I was working with international humanitarian organizations in Uganda. I saw that uh, it was better than other universities in terms of timing, like the flexibility of the timetable at this university and its nearness uh, in terms of transport and that was perfect for me. The course is structured in the form of modules. So there are seven modules that students undertake which can cover a whole lot of streams from public health to research methods and practice. City offers a whole lot of things. First, you're taught by a faculty that has led research and practice in public health globally. You also have a really good student mix. Students come from all over the world and they have work experience in public health and there are a lot of many think tanks in London that can offer internship or placement opportunities for students. The students who come on the course, they have two to three years of work experience. They have worked in the public health sector before. It can be clinical experience, they could be say midwives, nurses, doctors in health systems or they could have been working in the community and ministries of health. So they need to have some kind of background in public health. A Masters of Public Health at City will help me uh, in terms of career progression because I've been implementing projects at a level of program coordinator and now I'm looking at uh, progressing to the level of program manager or managing health projects in the humanitarian sector. So in terms of career prospects, students go on to work in the public and the private sector. So in the public sectors, they could be advisors to ministries of health, to uh, general government committees. They could also go on to work in uh, international organizations, funders, charities, NGOs. Or if they have a research inclination, they can go on to do a PhD and get into academics and research. The course is fairly flexible. It offers both part-time and full-time modes of study. And of course, uh, it's in London, so it, it's a great hub to be in. After graduating at the University of London, I managed to get a research position. I feel I have the right skills that would help me to succeed in my next career. <laughs>